hi guys i'm back with another video and today i'll be showing you how i make these cute little led signs with my glowforge today i'm going to be working on the sign that's more of a halloween theme but you can choose any thing that you want so i just chose to do one for my craft room and this is how you get started so what you do first is i measured my led base to see how big the slit was so we'll know how large to make our square so we'll be able to get it to stand mine was about 2.75 inches so I'm just making a little square of the same size in the silhouette studio so you just go down to the side and you select your shape I just selected the square because it's the same as my base and then I enter the measurements I needed at the top Next, I went ahead and did my height of the little square. I made it about one and a half inches. I wanted to stick out enough that is sh not showing too high, but not so it's too short where we can't get it to stand out of the base. So one and a half inches seems to work pretty well. Then I went ahead and chose the shape of my sign. I went with the circle and you can choose how big or small you want to make it once you choose your shape you're going to go ahead and overlap it with the square leaving um, about half of it out and then you'll select both of the figures together right click go down the well and now we have the base of our led sign So now that we have the base of our sign, you can basically start decorating any way that you want. I'm just gonna start with my text. I'm gonna put my name and then Spooky Craft Room since it's October. And then I'll just add some jack-o'-lanterns and other little things to the sign. So to add some of the images, I just went online and I typed in spiderweb PNG and I brought it back into my silhouette and I used the trace feature on the side. It kind of looks like the butterfly is highlighted here. You go ahead and trace it and then I'm just going to resize it to add it to my sign and I'll do it again here with some of my other images to find uh, pumpkins to just make this sign a little more Halloween themed. So here's how our sign will look. It's important to go ahead and select the text and images and fill it in. That way when you take it into the Glowforge Studio, it will be easier for you to decipher what you wanna do with each of the items. So I'm just gonna go ahead and save it and then I'm gonna go over to my Glowforge. So now that we have our image in Glowforge, we just wanna get it set up on our materials where we want it, I'm using a fourth of an inch clear, I'm sorry, an eighth of an inch clear acrylic, and then we're just gonna watch it cut. It's all done cutting. We just need to get it set up in our LED base. If you would like your own theme sign, it can be made to any theme that you like. Check out the link below at the Dream Doctors. I'll have it listed in the description box. Thanks for watching.